somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. Over there's Diamond Dave Damone. This is the Appleton Oak. That's the answer. I'm Mason Quinn. Folks, today we got a big surprise tonight. We're taking a look at Love and Basketball from 2000. This has our guy Omar Epps in it, who we all absolutely <laughs> loved in the wood. We loved him in the program. We loved him in Major League, too. Two. He's our guy. Really uh, amazing. Hey. A lot of you folks who uh, loved our, our wood reaction also recommended this one. So the I have, wood. The yeah, wood. The wood. <laughs> the wood. <laughs> they know. Anyways, hey, we, we had so much fun with that. You guys recommended it. So I know nothing about this. Obviously, a first time watch. Can't wait to check it out. Obviously, I love Omar Epps and, you know, the program and that. And then also he was in House where he's very dramatic. Egg, so I'm hoping that's what I get to see here. So I'm definitely ready, willing, and able to see some love in basketball. I know nothing about this whatsoever, <laughs> but I share these guys' sentiment. I'm really excited to come into this one. I know nothing. I'm just going to take what they said and echo it. So with that being said, let's go! Swish! That's horse. Uh-uh! Oh! Be like Kareem. Kareem. I want this big butt do a stand by the basket. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, Q. I thought you said only girls are moving in. Betty, she's a scrub like Kelvin. Shut <laughs> up. Can I play? No. Wow. <laughs> you nice? Yeah, I'm nice. You and Kelvin against me and Jamal. Oh, she's oh, got her hair tucked up in yeah. her hat. Hey. <laughs> oh, man, he is a girl. He's about to get schooled. Yeah. What a dog. It's like shades of uh, Reggie and Cheryl Miller. <laughs> she used to school him all the time. <laughs> Look at the bends in the back. The old bends, yeah. <laughs> oh, hop the car! Oh, 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 oh Dad saw that. Oh, that be your ass. <laughs> did, you, did that say big ass on the license plate? Well, come on, the shot from the yes. trunk of the car had to be worth like five cents. Yeah, that's got to count for double or something. <laughs> no, I got you. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 oh, I thought she was going into the post. Oh, Bro, you better get over there and help. Oh, oh that's a bad one. Oh, what happened? Yeah, I missed it. Oh, she had a cut on her face. Yeah, I don't she know how that down. happened. Maybe a rock how the hell did that happen, though? Come here. Should be fine. Let me find you some gauze. Oh, making a card. That's nice. What year is this from again, guys? 2000. 2000. Hey, Pedro oh, Serrano. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 This came back from the insurance hey, he threw office. Hey, baseball to him, too. Hmm. Nice <laughs> That's voice. That's how your mom's caught me. Can't do this shit. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Well, what did I tell you about using that word? Can't should never be in a man's vocabulary. Because when you say can't, you ain't a man. That's right. Seek. Oh, yeah. Don't say shit. <laughs> <laughs> I got to meet him trophies. Some business folks. I got maybe two years left to play. See you later, man. Oh, oh, look at Bucks. 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 All right. Look at that. Home team. So how long have y'all been here? And the neighborhood was a little more mixed back then. That was before the black people down the street became the black people next door. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> this was terribly nice of you, Nona. Oh, girl, don't worry about it. And I love to cook. You do? <laughs> <laughs> I have never seen the inside of this house. Well, let's just have a look. Prince, help her. <laughs> <laughs> So how come you can play basketball? Your dad play? Who works at a bank? <laughs> My dad plays for the Clippers. He says I'm going to be a doctor or a lawyer, but I'm going to play for them too. Same number and everything. Well, I'm going to be number 32 like magic. <laughs> He's all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, if anybody messes with you, just let me know. Hmm. Well, I know karate from Almighty Isis. <laughs> <laughs> you want to do karate in the garage? <laughs> Ow, Lena. Ow. Monica, sit still. Someone had put your box of dresses underneath a pile of rags in the oh, garage. I wonder who did that. <laughs> <laughs> Her sister. 
No, I think she did. Yeah, she she did it. She didn't want to wear them. She wants the ball. Booster. Seeing her sister is laughing because sure. she knows it was her. Mm -hmm. You know, that boy next door is going to ride to school with you tomorrow. Do you know somebody? Her dad is in Man of Steel. He's uh, one of the generals or something like that. Okay. Somebody correct me. Yeah, he's been, in a, he's been in a lot. Mm -hmm. Is that true? Not what uh, we're hearing there. <laughs> not what you want to have uh, to listen to as a teenager. <laughs> oh man, first day of school, you got to go on with a bandage. Mm -hmm. You want to be my girl? <laughs> whoa, whoa. What do I have to do? What do I have to do? We can play ball, and when you get mad at me, I got to give you flowers. <laughs> but I don't like flowers. How about Twinkies? My mom won't ever buy them. Okay. Damn it. How, how do I get money for that? <laughs> I think we got a kiss long? now. <laughs> for how great. long? Five seconds? Over there. <laughs> Boy, just that <laughs> easy, huh? <laughs> they just put their bikes down. <laughs> oh, they got to imagine busted. the mom's going to catch them. Or the sister. <laughs> 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 he was counting. Oh, first Look kiss. Look at that. Ah, oh, your first love <laughs> that you end up forgetting. <laughs> Never. Oh, Diamond Dave. But I want to ride my own bike. My dad always drives my mom. Forget you then, stupid. Your dad plays for the worst team in the NBA. Last time they won, Dr. J was a nurse. Shut up. Oh, oh Jesus. He did it again. Why don't I be your oh. girlfriend? Big hand. That didn't last very long. <laughs> wow, that, uh, that escalated quickly. Oh, her dress is going to get grass stains on it. Oh, going for the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you understand the metaphoric phrase, light as a rock? 32, here she is. Nice, I like the like home video. Yeah. Mm -hmm. ah, oh, boy. Oh, oh, get that out of here. <laughs> mm, not in my oh, 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 oh. Come on, come on, come on. Get in. You got to keep it in check. No. You suck. <laughs> no. Shut up. By the way, I don't think coaches can get away with that. Not anymore. They used to back in our day. Not saying that's right, folks. I'm just saying you can't mm -hmm. do that anymore. <clears throat> Corinda, suck, suck, suck. Oh, they're keeping her out. Tell him to keep me on the floor. You've lost your head. I was just showing emotion. So is that Gina? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's time you start thinking about other things besides basketball. You've got one game left and you haven't been recruited. Was it her senior year? It must be. Oh, she hasn't been recruited by anybody. Hey, my mom's about to be home. So I'm not good enough to meet your moms? If my mom's know how to hide you like you up in the crib. <laughs> <laughs> They're too back and forth. Uh, can't right. do those cheers anymore, no. can you? No. Yay, sports. What was some of the wildest cheers you heard back in high school? Let us know. Oh, he's he's going with a full t shirt underneath the uh, yeah. jersey. Man. <laughs> So, um, you know who's asking to the spring dance? Come on, go your roof right next door. Just tell me who's been creeping. There's just so many, I just can't keep track. Oh, passing notes. Look at that booty. I'm Thanks, guys. Quincy. So help me out. Where's it going to be? No, I'd love for him to get a good education. See you at the press conference. Just like the program. <laughs> Just, uh... <laughs> Isn't See, it what? funny? In Major League Two, they're teammates. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, now he's a father's son. <laughs> I don't care about the team, Quincy. I care about the school. Uh, Played a good game today, man. I was proud of you. Thanks, man. Worked too hard, Pop. Now let's hope I can say the same about you someday. God, what a great uh, bond they have. That's awesome. Wait, who? I know this. <laughs> What you want? Hey, hey, don't touch the radio, all right? <laughs> Appreciate the ride home. What's that? 
Some no Shawnee Easton told me to give you. Shawnee <laughs> with the big ass titty. <laughs> <laughs> If I had water, I would have spit it out. Oh, my God. <laughs> I want a bone. She's honest. I didn't know you cared so much. I don't. <sighs> Who are you going to the dance with anyway? Spalding? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. She hits. Mama. What up? is this? That's, that's your earring. <laughs> Run. Now I'm telling you, these girls are looking to get you caught. Where's your dad? Oh, he said he'd be home later. I don't know. He said he had a meeting or something. I'm not getting anywhere, like punching a clock just so my wife doesn't get an attitude. You know, you said that you would think about going back and getting your degree. We got just enough savings to keep your fine ass in Gucci and go. Uh oh. How many nice is my fine? Oh! Ah, oh, so he goes and sees Monica. Oh, he stays with her. Yeah, it's like she knows the whole drill and everything. What's going on with you in the spring dance? I found you somewhere. Found? <laughs> <laughs> Who is he? His brother from my college. How'd you give him a say yes? I told him you look like me. You ever been in love? Too many times. <laughs> She's still in college, <laughs> though. Uh. So we gonna play smart and with control. Who's house? See house. Swerve's house. house. <laughs> <laughs> Had to. Sorry, y'all. <clears throat> Don't get tight. She's laying off. She's laying off. Pull up. Toss her. Take it right. Watch left. Watch left. Yep, yeah. yeah, mom. One. Play smart. Can I put that out there. What? Reach your head. One and one. Monica. Keep it together. Yeah, that was close. I thought she was going to maybe lose it. Okay, so they're going to get one and ones. Then go up by one. She can get the ball. Be the hero. Keep it together. Okay, kind of like you were saying, Dave. Up by one. Yep. It's on your mind. Yep. Let's go. Pull, come pull on, press. Come on, Ron. Get there, please. Oh. Damn. A couple of seconds. Why'd she shoot a three, though? Holding, that's fine. Yep, she's out now. Oh, she's uh, out already. It might help if you didn't look so evil. Go look in my top drawer and bring your grandmother's pearls. Ooh. For the spring dance? <laughs> I know it's a special occasion, but I'm just saying like the gravity of it all. Mm. Mom's happy. I just want you to enjoy being beautiful. Will you do that? Thanks, sweetie. She was so, if you've seen the movie Radio, she was so good. Mm, I haven't seen that. it. I didn't I, see that. You guys haven't seen? I've seen it once nope. a long time ago. That's good. She though. was so good in Radio. <laughs> oh, bad medicine dance party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we have the same right, lighting in the studios. Right. I want to see the fashion they had going on back in the day. Oh, yeah, you know? this is 88. You got the silk shirts. Oh, oh if you didn't have a... Hey. Dance, dance, not just... Uh, he was in uh, Last Whoa. Man on Earth. What's his name? She wasn't kidding. Yeah. That guy's a he looks, solid 9 out of yeah, 10 handsome. He, he looks I mean, like he's 32. Yeah, he doesn't... Yeah, well, he's, he's in college, but... Yeah. She, looks like a velour. Don't look half bad. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dude. So you're going to be my girl? <laughs> so black. <laughs> it's like... Uh, some awkward tension here. So tell me what I have to do to make you have a good time with me. My mouth is kind of dry. Then I'll get you some punch. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine? Yep. Oh, this clown. <laughs> <laughs> Spalding. <laughs> Spalding. <laughs> so you took Shawnee, huh? He was late. You want to dance? <sighs> Slow dances at high school dances. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, here yeah. we go. Oh, get the eye contact. Oh. The eye contact during the slow dance. Mm-hmm. You can just tell. Oh, is she creeping in his window? It's not creeping. No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> that would that no, never it's her, to it's me her back own in the house. Day. That's <laughs> her house. <laughs> it's her house she was looking yeah. at. Oh, I wasn't sure if she was looking at Well, their bedrooms are right across. Rust I wasn't crossed, sure if she was yeah. looking in his bedroom. He's got oh, uh, square she's, windows. Oh, she, she saw. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, it's, oh, oh, God, these seats make me nervous. Oh, Is look he, who's in his room by himself. Yeah. <laughs> where's your man? Oh, God. Oh. High where's school your, love. Oh, uh, where's your clown? The gold chain Who with the numbers. I told Shawnee it was time to go. I was sitting in Jason's ride with him, and he was kissing on me and feeling on me. And yeah, you didn't want to hear that. Oh. I couldn't remember how many offensive boards I had in the chair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, four, four offensive rebounds. Oh, look at that. Uh, yeah. Let's see. It was on my desk when I came. Damn, Damn girl. girl. Got it. Yep. They want you? Yes. Yes. <laughs> 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 the quietest celebration ever. I guess what? I remember Dad wanted him to go to USC, yeah. too. Well, no, Dad wanted him to go wherever. Oh, yeah. He wanted He's going, too. <gasps> yep. Oh! Yeah. The Dad wanted him to go to an Ivy League. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh! oh! What's that about? Whoops. I know, right? Oh, he did. Oh! Uh, oh, 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 there it is. He bit the lower lip. Hey! Oh! Maybe. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> a little false start on there. <laughs> Sometimes that's all it takes. You see somebody with somebody else, and it gets that, that little, like, a you know, a little bit of jealousy, and all of a sudden it just triggers something. Not a single grass stain on that white dress. I may or may not have had a very, oh, oh, very similar experience my junior year in high school. I'm sorry to hear that. No, things worked out. <laughs> <laughs> things worked out. Not with the parents' home. Oh, no. Does this well, turn in? No, no. Oh, no. Into, no, it, it's not going to go bad, I don't think. Well, I'm not saying it'll be bad, but they're both 18, right? Mm. What if, oh, with the parents' home? Something. With their it's grandmother's the pearls on? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. She's got grandma's pearls on. Uh, hey, you know, as long as the necklace ain't broke, I'm yeah. so nervous that parents Mom are broke, home. You know, blow a gasket. Nah, the the music they're playing, I think it's gonna be fine. We're assuming <laughs> you know what happens quarter. from this point on, guys. Oh, we didn't oh, do too much of a time jump. Freshman, you're getting spanked. You trying to tell me you can't take a little charge? Take it. That's a different world. Next. Next. Yeah, the way she Next, said. Well, yeah. The way she said it too. You finished your read for econ? Yeah. You gonna take us to the final floor? We'll see. I'll be watching. You do see me standing here, right? Can't be nice to a fan. Fine, Quince. Binge. Oh, <laughs> He's throwing her down. <laughs> I thought so too. You the only one I know who's for real. Yeah. Hmm. That's true. Oh, there we oh. go. Oh, 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 for the oh, 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 oh show it off. <laughs> yeah, but no. Oh, yeah, left it, left oh. it open. Well, you're so busy posing, your man just scored. You like to pose so much, let's see it again. The coaches don't screw around, man. <laughs> I want you to stand like that for the rest of practice. That's so stupid. <sighs> That's what you get for trying to show out. Freshman. I was just playing ball. You were trying to make me look bad. You didn't have to try very hard. Oh, shit. Here we go. The only reason you're here is because Tanya Randall got pregnant and decided not to come. That's code, Sid. Just thought the girl should know. Don't even trip, Mom. You just mad because she's full leg. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, at least the other players are coming around to her now. Yeah. Because yeah. they saw what she could do on the court. So how about a little one-on-one? I score, you strip. <laughs> oh, oh, a sock. A sock. 
First try, let me try. Oh, what? Oh. 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 It's a thing. Hmm. Oh, no. <laughs> he is terrible <laughs> at whistling, I gotta say. Oh! oh. 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 <laughs> he was looking, looking out for that oh, elbow. It's right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I won. I wanted you to. It's about emotion. It's about determination. And I'm like a kid in a candy <laughs> store. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Dickie me, baby. <laughs> Anyone else find Dick Vitale annoying? Let me know. <laughs> This guy's all. <laughs> that's yeah, that, that's exactly how Diamond sounds. <laughs> <laughs> you nailed it. <laughs> Zeke and Q. How are you doing, Terry? What kind of gift are you? Here? People saying I'm a definite lottery pick. Oh, oh, Dad wants him to stay in school. Yep. Quincy, give yourself time to develop. Mm -hmm. Get an education. There's this thing out there, this paternity suit. What? Ooh. Some girl that's been hanging on at every party. Now I'm supposed to be her baby's daddy. Oh, Ooh. what a bombshell. It's not true, is it? Got the balls to ask me. <laughs> well, it's fair, Pops. Yeah. You need to hear me say it. I'll say it. It's not true. Thank you. I mean, it could be Pedro Serrano's. Uh. Can I get your autograph? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Uh, How dad dad's, dad's proud. Sign an autograph? Yeah. All right, let's get Monica in this game. Oh, yeah, here superstar, we go. Oh, superstar went well, down. I should have clapped an injury, <laughs> but. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, oh, oh no, mom. Oh, what was that? Oh, she's were those been, papers? So is she filing? She's had a few too many seven ups. It's about that. Truth's bound to come out sooner or later. Whose mm. truth are you talking about? We can't let something like this break up the family. How many times you yourself been told me to watch these hoes out there? I should have been telling your father that. Oh. <sighs> she got proof? Yep. Oh. Ain't that pathetic? I am too tired. Thank you, I know he messed up, but that doesn't change what he's been to you. Yeah. There's that. Yeah. Man looked me in my eye and he lied to me like it was nothing. I never thought my papa would do something like that. Game. I have, she probably has curfew. Mm -hmm. Coach has us on 11 o'clock curfew. If I'm late, I don't suit up. Oh, I hope he understands. Well, he should. He's a player, too. I mean, I'm sure his coach is just as hard on them. I, I can stay a few more minutes. I'm sweating. Oh, he's damn uh. he's upset. He should understand that. I should be alone right now. Nah, he's okay. he's fine with it. Well, for the no, second. Yeah. no, uh, he's not. Can you call me when you get in? I'll stay up. Yeah, so he's that's not. sacrifices you got to make as an athlete, man. It's not easy. Yeah, she needs to get out. Yeah, but she's because we've seen she's been busting her ass and yep. hopefully can get on the floor. He has it easy. He probably he's doesn't just have a natural curfew, talent. Right? He's got easy street. And he's got literally, it. she's been fighting for. Yeah, an no, inch she needs to get each back. Time. He's. I don't. He's. I know he's going through it right now, but he should have been a little bit more. I mean, he was. He was cool about. Yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. He was fine with it. You know. Yeah, oh, game's now he's going to be off. Now the script's going to flip for. Now she's going to start balling. Yeah. There's the pick. He's not seeing anybody. She gonna take the shot this time? Oh no 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 no! Here she comes, block. Ah, oh, take the charge. This is playing smart. Ah, ah. <clears throat> nope. Oh. Oh, shot. Offensive. Oh, oh, I was gonna say that was a charge. <laughs> They're not gonna call that. Ooh, playing smart. A little nepotism there, or? Hmm. Well, that's that's her girl. They wanted her to make star. a player out of her. Monica. <laughs> uh oh. What? 
Oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Better be cute. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> What's this? Why'd, she, why'd they show the kid like that? Yeah. You could have given up after you threw that ball away. You showed real heart. Thanks, coach. Starting. I'm starting your point again. I thought. Sidra's ankle was okay for next game. You want the job or not? It just seems like you're always riding me. Here comes the explanation. Here it comes. You think I go horse for a player with no potential? Uh-huh. When I ignore you. Yep. Then you worry. Yep. Did it. Hey. Yeah, had a high school football coach like that. Yep, that's what they all say. I came by your crib. Derek says you, you'd be here. Mm. Well, we went to celebrate after. Did you hear about your girl? She won the starting spot. Hey, what did Kay get? It's what happened. Wow, that Whoa. was underwhelming. Whoa. Yeah. Just wanted to say good game. But, <laughs> no buts. <laughs> Just one word of advice for next season. Never let a freshman take your spot. Oh. Ouch. Uh-oh. If everything was going so well. Oh. I like me, man. Monica's not going to like that. Who was that? This party's whack. Ready to go? You want to go talk? Not really. You can finish what we were talking about last night. I don't think he... you. You, you quit. You know what? I'm gonna just I'm gonna go crash. Maybe I'll come by later. Nah, I got curfew. Ah, <laughs> oh, sir. Oh, he was salty about it. Yeah. I know he's hurting because Pops lied to him, but right. he should still understand, though. Yeah, plus he's on the liquor, too, so. Well, I'm just even referring <laughs> yeah, to them. What are you doing here? I messed up, okay? I know that. But I ain't that kid's father. Lucky kid. You so perfect you can look down on me? Your mama's real quick to show you those pictures, huh? No, she was 19 when she got pregnant. You're trying to say my mother trapped you? I'm saying I handled my <sighs> responsibilities like a man. And when you're in the NBA, there's a hundred girls waiting down in that lobby. Listen to me. Since we're being so honest, I figured that I'd tell you I decided to drop out of school and turn pro. But I cannot let you do this. I always thought Kent wasn't in the man's vocabulary. Ooh, call, good callback. She's hustling. Yep. You win? Yeah, I hit four threes. God, I wish it would have showed a little bit more of her game instead of just the slide for the yeah. ball. <clears throat> yeah, but he's saying he had this... Right in front of her? What? What the hell is that all about? Well, oh, Monica, this is Carrie. Carrie, this is Monica. Oh. What's going on? About to go get some food. You want to come? What? <sighs> Maybe I should come back. No, you stay. I'll leave. What the hell are you doing, Quincy? Oh, she went home. What are you doing here? No, I needed a reason to come home. Is everything OK? Yeah. Good. I'm going down the market to get some things for dinner. Will you join us? I don't know. It's just a game. Uh, wasn't about that, Mom. Well, in fairness to the mom there, that's, that's exactly all she's how seen. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She had time for me. So you messed around <laughs> oh. to prove a point? What'd I just say? You forgot to be there. I'm a ball player. If anybody knows what that means, it should be That's you. what I'm saying. If we're going to be together, I have to be able to trust you. I'm not asking for us to be together. What? Where's Richard T. Jones right now? I'm like, you're f***ing this up. <laughs> Whatever I did, we can fix this. I don't think so. What? You don't think so? Look, I'm entering a draft. When did you decide all this? A few days ago. i still like us to be friends. Oh. Oh, that's the worst. He's getting like we've He's getting, seen. Yeah, Superstar yeah. treatment, her, none of that. Yeah. She had to earn it. Right. Oh, here we go. Fourth quarter, quarter. 1993. Oh, so four years later. A Zowry Zaz. Because remember, it was only 18. He needed to be in the NBA at that point. Yeah. Oh, oh maybe she is playing overseas. That, that made sense because, because the, other ball the other girl was there. there. Yep. Yeah. Hola, Monica. Buena suerte. Cada año después de la temporada. Oh, they got tape their own ankles. Oh, remember the ankles too. Omar was or Q mm-hmm. was putting icy hot and stuff on him. Este año es el próximo año. Este es el campeonato. Oh, oh yeah, all of it. He's saying that we keep saying next year, keep saying next year, keep saying next year. He says this is next year. Oh, I, I didn't know you were fluent. 
Lisa, what did he say? He said to give the ball to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, oh. I'm going to love winning this championship in your house. This ain't college, and I ain't on crutches. I'm surprised they were kind of surprised because don't you think they would know? The, I mean, not uh, roster. I mean, they'd be watching tape on yeah. the team, but yeah, you, uh, yeah, I'll go with it. I'll go with it. Yeah. Oh, I want oh, to see come that game. On. Come on. They better not have skipped the game. They better be like putting in highlights and in, intertwined with us. Oh, come on. <laughs> Can you take that damn thing off the table? Uh, I guess we know. <laughs> I guess. Hey. What are these Spanish guys like? I wouldn't know. You mean you've been over here seven months and you ain't tapping nothing? No, oh, just not my type, I guess. You remember Big Tony? She quit last year and now she works at some bookstore. They treat us like Hollywood stars over here. We just played in the championship game. It doesn't get much sweeter than this. In a nice restaurant, mm -hmm. living it up. Ah, family matters. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> God, what a show. <laughs> Stool, this game is in the refrigerator. The doors closed, the lights are out, big. And here come the subs. And you know, it's nice to see the subs. Oh, oh he made oh. the Lakers. He did. He's moved around quite a bit, but now he's trying to find a home. Oh, oh no! Uh, Nona, how is it? Not great. He tore his ACL. Uh. Yep. Almost didn't recognize you with your hair like that. How you been? Happy. And he won't want to see you. Oh. Can he at least know that he came? Nope. New man in oh. life. Yep. He made sports, huh? What do you want? Oh, Just came by to check on you. Five years. I thought it was weird that he wasn't in the stands. Yeah. Don't get down on yourself. Stop taking your advice a long time ago. You want me to step off, man? Yeah. Fine. But not until I still see. A better ball player than I ever was. You're smart, Quincy. How come you couldn't be the man you kept trying to make me? I just couldn't, so. You know, while he had his personal faults, he was still always a dad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Morning. Is he already up trying to walk around? No. Oh, yeah, bathroom, okay. Bathroom, yeah. Oh. Monica. She's looking she's looking jacked. She's looking jacked. Mm -hmm. well, <laughs> even she's, more so than ripped. Well, she's playing pro yeah. now. They're probably playing a lot more games. Oh, <laughs> she's just looking she's so got jacked after though. seven months. Even more than what she was before. I heard you were in Spain. I was. 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 Yeah, did you catch was. that? Yeah. Well, the I mean, season would be over. It's cold. Well, so is basketball done for both of them now? So when are you going back? I'm not. Yep. What do you mean? No family, no friends. My phone bill is ridiculous. It was back in the back 90s. then. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it was a call overseas collect. Uh, I mean, basketball just isn't fun for me anymore. You know? No. Tyra, Tyra Banks. Banks? <laughs> <laughs> What? What? Is <laughs> <laughs> higher learning before or after this? Oh, higher learning was before this. And higher learning was like 95. Yeah. Maybe even earlier. Well, this was 2000. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Never mind. Yeah, yeah. Higher learning was the 90s. Sorry. Monica. Oh, you guys grew up together, right? This is Kara. I don't think she got Kara. Kara. <laughs> and Tyra. Oh. Oh. I don't think she got the whole truth. Uh, I hate to be Debbie Downer, but is a fiance going to be gone with him not being in the league? There's a strong, uh, there's a strong possibility. Your sister's bringing the baby by later, so. Oh. Yeah, I can't wait to see her. Stanty. I, I just saw Quincy engaged. The last steward is. So what do I do? That way they're registered and send them again. What do you want me to say, Monica? Go over there and beat up the girl? I'd rather bake a pie than shoot a stupid jump up shot. <laughs> <laughs> jump up shot. Jump up shot. I remember when I was eight years old. 
And you didn't say anything. You never stood up for yourself. If I was ashamed, it was because of that. It's ridiculous is not being a cater, knowing his woman's home cooking and ironing his drawers. Oh! Oh, oh Monica. I'm sorry. When your daddy and I got married, yes, I had dreams. But I happened to have gotten pregnant with Lena. Your spring dance? That day I was happy I didn't have a catering business to run off to. She was always there. I must have played in a thousand games. And I can only remember you being at uh, two. You know it never mattered to you one way or another while I was at them games. Yeah, I think it did. It, did. it mattered. Well, what an interesting uh, dynamic for the mother-daughter yeah. relationship there. I mean, there. they're both had very valid points, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. yeah. Come on, this isn't what you're supposed to do. Oh, oh we're with dad. Oh, this is working with dad. Oh, dad's on the wall there. Yeah. Huh? It's the big wheel. Oh, they're packing up his stuff from his room. Oh, oh she didn't oh, want the cue. Come on. Uh, well, it's good to see he's at least coming back because yeah, I, I, I thought his career was going to be over. He's got the Stone Cold Steve uh, Austin Steve brace. Rehabbing. Yeah. yeah. The well, I, I know, but he's still I, I, with the team uh, and, you know. Oh, it's so different. Oh, she's in the heels. heels. I mean, your mom had to beat you into a dress. Visiting? Karen's out of town for a couple of days. I didn't get to send you an invitation, but... No, you oh, it's okay. It's okay. I'm probably... You know. She probably has curfew that <laughs> night. <laughs> you never told me why a ball wasn't fun anymore. Seems like I needed a ball when I was trying to be like my pop. Trying to be better than my pop. Now it's time to try something different. I'm thinking about going back to school. Man, I never knew a girl. I never knew anyone who loved ball as much as you. Just leave it alone, all right? Nah, she's still got the fire. She just wanted to be back home. Mm -hmm. I always admired was the fight in you. What are you talking about? When I said I thought Quincy could do better, I was talking about you. Well, only two weeks to go. If you're going to make a move. Oh, make a <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? They need to talk. Oh, he's not climbing out of a window with his knee. Jesus, guy. <laughs> he's about to, though. This guy. Oh, he is. Like, you weren't nervous. I mean, he's favoring I'm nervous. Bit, but it's We're also... not nervous for the same reasons. <laughs> but it's also been a while. It's not fun for me anymore because you're missing. You haven't talked since college? I don't know. I probably should have said it two weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> you still think the sun rises and sets on your ass? Oh. Ooh, that's... Guess what? It doesn't. Fair on both sides? Mm. One game, one-on-one. -on -one. <laughs> for what? Your heart. You out of your mind. So what, you gonna jump? Oh! <laughs> I should have been there for you. After that stuff with my dad, couldn't trust anybody, okay? That was five years ago. I've moved on. If I win, it's because deep down you know you're about to make the biggest mistake of your life. You scared? I have better things to do. Yeah, he can't. Oh. Yeah, his knee ain't happening. Oh, she's gonna do the reverse. She's gonna let him win? Three zip. Where's the D? She knows his knees messed yeah. up. Oh, oh, okay. oh, that's no, oh, don't take the brace off. Maybe he is hey. healed and was just playing scared. Oh. Hey, Austin. Austin always wore the knee brace. So she just unlocked his old self. Yep. Because he can play. <laughs> uh, that's her move. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I actually don't know how this is going to turn out. I have no idea. Yeah. Oh, they've God. done God. such a good job. So anxious, guys. <laughs> they've done such a good job this whole movie with all the characters. Hey, I oh. do. You only me and me. Oh, I just got it. He is the big shot. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is the one. She let him walk right by. Oh, oh no, no, not on. Touch you. Oh, Spay and loving basketball, right? Oh, I guess I didn't know how I thought this was gonna yeah. end, but well, I mean, I, 
when you think about it, like, is he really going to ditch his wedding two weeks out from his fiance he's been with for how many years? Well, when you think about it logically. <laughs> <laughs> but this is a movie. I wanted a happy ending. Hey. Double or nothing. Oh, one shot. Here we go. Hey. Oh. There we go. I was going to say, All no right. way. <laughs> Are they going to at least give us a, a sad ending? Oh, the Western Forum. Kareem. Kareem. Oh, it's. Oh, hey, she's with the, yeah, okay. the Sparks. Let's speak tonight's this magic. Oh, is this the first game they ever did, maybe? Hey, is that Leslie? Yeah, that's Leslie. There she is. Nice. Right, McCall. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Go, Mom. Well, I mean, he technically could be an they NBA, don't. too, because they're not going on at the same time. Right. Right. So maybe he is. I mean, they probably hey. won't say anything, but we, Good we, job, can, Gina. Think we can have high hopes, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go with he. Uh, oh, Spike How does Lee. Saw 5, Saw five come up after this? It's recommended. It's like, <laughs> recommended next. I'm next. Saw 5. Like, what? Yeah, the uh, Amazon Prime algorithm. <laughs> Amazon, what is up with your algorithm? What's going on? Uh, romantic Did comedy. Did you like Phenomenal love and basketball? Romantic what comedy? about Saw 5? <laughs> about life and love and yep. winning and losing. And, you know, when you're done. Now we saw the way you like that knee Whoa. injury. How would you like this? <laughs> yeah, you see you like to play a game. Hey. Great job. Oh, hey. uh, this is awesome. What a, you know, man. God, I was, what was Kyla Pratt in again? Harry the, the Lennox, young, Nathan young Wright. Yeah, That's, okay. That was who it was. I was so glad the that Monica. they did the flashback to them as kids, very similar to what we saw in The Wood. And it was just so fun seeing them grow up. I like how they did it by quarters, obviously. Yeah. That was a lot of fun because it was a lot of laughs when they were kids. We were all having a lot of fun with that. Obviously, there was a lot of nostalgia for us, you know, with the with the dances and a lot of the fashion. Obviously, the music was fantastic. But the you know, the one thing that I and I think I mentioned it on maybe another reaction we might have done, but you know, whether you're an athlete of a high level an actor, a musician, comedian, whatever, you know, a lot of times to be the best in your field. And even if, you know, it could be even business, you could be a high level executive, whatever. And you have to be absolutely on to be the best in your field, whatever it is. And a lot of times friends and family suffer for that. And they have come number two you know nobody wants to say that but you know for pro athletes that's how that is and i think uh, you saw a lot are you gonna give me a minute here you sound like a seal over here <laughs> jeez <laughs> <laughs> you go quick but anyhow so what i'm getting at is that there was a lot of flawed characters in this movie that i really liked but yet they all had points that they all made on each end like you know uh the dad you know trying to give his son good advice. The mom trying to give him good advice to watch out for things. You know, the dad ended up having his flaws, but still wanted to be there for his son, even though his son didn't really understand, didn't really want anything to do with them after a while. You know, both, you know, Monica, uh, you know, she had her flaws a little bit, you could say by, you know, not necessarily, you know, maybe making the move when she should have. And, you know, it was just, it was so refreshing to see a movie where not everybody's perfect. Not everybody has the answer every time. And I just, I really like to see that. And, you know, uh, and to that point, yeah. they let life happen, right? Exactly. As much as like yep. Zeke tried to, you know, steer mm -hmm. um, Omar in the right direction. Mm -hmm. He made, he made the decision to, to, to come out pro. And, you know, I really liked how they did the transitions where we got to see Monica having to basically start from the bottom and work her way up. Whereas Quincy was a superstar when he came in. He could he could ball out like none other. I mean, a freshman starting, you know, for uh, obviously, a you know, USC big time school. And... And it was just it was just so neat to see that that back and forth that they had. I also liked how early on I thought that, you know, Quincy and his dad had this great relationship when he was still in high school. And they did. And, you know, it was they had those couple of moments that I thought were really nice together. I liked the moments that Monica finally had with her mom at the end yeah. where, you know, her mom finally got to get it out a little bit where, you know, she's like, hey, you know, I was, you know, 
raised two kids who obviously turned out great, you know, uh, supporting, you know, supporting the husband, supporting the family, you know, she was, that was her role and, and she took that on and, and she loved it. And, you know, there's, there's nothing wrong with that. And I, I really liked that point that she made now she also wanted Monica to be something she wasn't. So again, there's our flawed character that, you know, we've, we've, that I talked about earlier. She wanted Monica to be something she wasn't. And it's just like, she finally at the end, it kind of got to see her for who she was as weird as that sounds. But and it was just, it was just very refreshing to see. I loved the, the back and forth with everybody. The comedy was great. The characters, the acting, everybody interacted so well. This was fantastic. A lot of fun. Well, I guess it's time for the seal over here to talk. Uh, you so, gonna stop interrupting, or should I do what you do? Uh, oh, well, oh, oh, oh! <laughs> three O's and I'm a seal. All right, no, uh, this was this was so much fun. I unfortunately I wasn't with the guys to see when they watched the wood. Mm. If it was anything like this, I'm sure I would have enjoyed it. Um, Dennis Haysbert was page fifteen. It was Dennis Haysbert was great in this as always as being the you know the father figure like you you know like in major league no but uh just like that he didn't want his downfalls to fall onto his son and it seemed like it worked at the beginning because like all the women are around now like we kind of discussed make the cut or not he said to, that he was listening to his mom about all the the girls coming around so we think that he was maybe listening to him so that he didn't make a mistake well we see why we find out later on it's because his mom got pregnant at 19 and he didn't want the dad didn't want marriage but he wanted to be you know respectful to his son and raise him right mm -hmm. and so and he didn't want him to look at him the way that he was looking at him in the dorm room yep. which you know that would have to you know suck for any father because for what they've all done but just this cast was amazing a lot of seeing these young faces from 2000 this is 23 years later <laughs> and how great of a job they did i mean we had the love story where you know <laughs> he pushed her over at the beginning <laughs> and then they also they they became boyfriend girlfriend for what two minutes uh they did a five second kiss <laughs> but then they were always friends and then we saw that when his parents were struggling he had a place to stay every night she she it's like she had the pillow and blanket all ready for him and just how their friendship then you know they got jealous over each other's dates at the dance and then they fell in love and were together and then we saw like you said you know them they couldn't meet in the middle, it seemed like, for their basketball careers in college. That one was a superstar, one was down and then on the rise, the other one was falling. Granted, he had a lot of stuff on his plate, but if, for that to happen to any like you know college freshman, I'm sure that's got to be rough. But man, then just the, the way the love story came back, we all thought it was going to be a sad ending. Yeah, it was looking that way. And then good old Q goes, double or nothing. Oh, perfect. <laughs> yeah, this was such a dynamic movie. Um, first off, the the thing that I really want to highlight is the on-screen chemistry. And we, we've watched lots of movies. That's what we do. And we've seen a lot of movies with a lot of great actors. Um, but it's it's hard to really replace on-screen chemistry and I really feel like this movie had that um, between all of the characters between between Zeke and um, <clears throat> his son um, between uh, Monica you know it's it's just it's it's been it's been a minute since we've seen, at least for me, this sort of on-screen chemistry. The story was really dynamic. Um, you know, they, they had this long-going friendship from when they were kids, all the way into high school, all the way, you know, into college, and then and then beyond. And it's something that, I gotta be honest, I think unless you live through that, it's something to really wrap your head around or, or be able to understand. I never had like a, a young, you know, f female friend that I was very, close with you know I just I had my guy friends like so many other people um, so you know when I you know like like a lot of other guys you know when I started meeting girls and stuff when you're a teenager you know I had my friends but there was never anybody I was really tight with and so I think um, you know answer brought up they always had somebody to lean on they always had somebody to go to their, their family had you know their, their own individual problems and and they it seemed like they could always count on each other during those years where you're growing up um, so much um, <clears throat> and recently I was having a discussion with somebody just saying like the friends you make when you're young uh, You know, especially your teenage years and stuff like that, you know junior high high school I, I think it's different than the kind of friends you make at any other point in your mm -hmm. life Just because of the life things you go through not only are you creating friendships and, and a bond over uh, You know similar interests and the things you have in common 
but you're just going through a, a, a very pivotal point in your life together. And so they had that really strong bond. Um, we saw that basketball brought them together. And I think it was so easy for people on the outside to look at them just as basketball, but they were two very unique individuals with their own things going on. Uh, you know, the, the, their college years, the silly breakups, the silly <laughs> fights, that was very relatable for me. I've had some, some weird breakups and some weird, you know, get back together and all sorts of stuff. Um, it, I really liked the way that they showed how she had to really fight for that spot and she was grinding mm -hmm. and she had a lot of pressure on her and, you know, Qu Quincy had it the opposite, um, you know, but when, when things got tough for her, she kind of grinded through it. Obviously the things that got tough for him were a lot different. It was family issues and he, he just didn't know, you know, he didn't know how to handle it. You know, um, he got drafted, made it to the league. So of course he was able to get his, uh, you know, get his stuff back together. But, um, you know, it's, I've never really been like a, it's meant to be type person or, <laughs> or destiny. I, I'm just not, I think life is a, a series of choices and consequences and uh, a, lot, a lot of coincidences. But, you know, when you have two people like this, it seemed like that bond was pretty unbreakable. And, you know, Mason Quinn, I'm not sure if it's gonna make the cut. Like you can look at it a couple of ways, like, look, Breaking up somebody's wedding two weeks before <laughs> is, is 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 bad, you know. And there's a handful of there's a handful of movies out there. I'm not going to name which ones because I don't want any spoilers for these guys if you're watching. But there's a handful of movies where like people are in love and you get back with the ex and it's like, oh, they got back together with the ex. It's like, yeah, but you ditched the <laughs> you ditched the person that you were with. They're you perfectly know? fine themselves. But, and I was waiting for them to make uh, Kira the the you know the like unlikable mm -hmm. and they didn't do look they did the cute yeah, right, she couldn't have that one. no not the cute my, my, my fiance <laughs> made me take my arnold posters out of the living room when oh. she moved in well, I, like, I, I guess you know what you gotta what do the <laughs> they can go in the gym or the office like why can't we have posters of arnold schwarzenegger in the living room <laughs> but in any regard uh, a really a really phenomenal movie i love the story of course despite everything in the end. Um, I, I love that they were back together. And I love that Monica had her chance to finally realize her dream as well. Mm -hmm. You know, compared I mean, to the mom, compared, <laughs> right? Well, compared yeah. to the mom, well, and I'm gonna touch on that real briefly, uh, briefly for me. Um, I love that she had the chance to make it into the league. They showed her getting to the top of her game, of course, playing over in Europe before the WNBA was here. There was a few year lag in between there. And, and we saw that with a lot of female basketball players who were the most, the elite of the elite, mm -hmm. playing in other countries, whether over in Asia or Europe. And when the WNBA came, they finally had a chance. And I think there was a handful of bigger players who hadn't played in a few years who came and did this. So you have to yeah. correct me if I'm wrong. Look, I'm not a WNBA historian, but I do recall hearing a couple of players who hadn't played for a few years when this opportunity came. The last thing I'm going to touch on is the mom story because I thought that was really powerful. I have worked from home since we've had my son and the time I have home with my son is I, I can't even I, I can't even articulate how important that has been to me. I understand that so many women out there have dreams and life happens and stuff happens. And, and so many times, you know, this is, this is America, it's all over the world. The female stays at home, the dad goes off and does whatever. And, um, you know, obviously it's important for everybody to go after their goals. And, you know, the mom, but the thing is, is that's not, sometimes we think like for, whether it be a mom or a dad or anybody, like I had to give up my dream and it's like, I'm telling you right now as a parent, there is nothing in my life that has been more special than spending time at home with my son. And so when the mom was talking about, I was home raising my girls, I was taking care of you. And so they had a recurring theme about the way that you picture life to be, and it doesn't always work out like that. And, and we hear that sometimes about, about women like, oh, I had my dream, but I stayed home to raise kids. And it's like, for some people, and look, for some women, that is giving up on their dreams. And you hear that, like, look, I had stuff I wanted to do, but for some women who had, like, this is the picture in my head, but instead I stayed home and raised kids. And what, what bigger role can anybody, not just a woman, a man, woman, anybody have in their life than being there and raising your children. So that was a really powerful moment. I'm glad you guys brought that up. Um, but, uh, you know, we finally got to see that in-depth conversation with her mom, but all around a phenomenal film from start to finish. Everything about this movie was fantastic. Yeah, I'm going to kind of bounce around a little bit over here. 
So I do wish they would have gave us more game time. Yeah. Like they set up perfectly for Monica. Yeah, when she was doing the, the slide. Point guard. Well, that uh, the the junior point guard. I forgot her name. Uh, it's probably in here somewhere. Oh, Silda. Uh, yeah, Silda. 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 Yeah. Like yeah. you, they set right here. Yeah, Sidra. 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 Oh, they, sorry. They set up a epic yeah. movie moment, in my opinion, where all right, we get Monica versus uh, Sidra uh, or Sidra, <laughs> and uh, like it was. They just gave us the the bump the shoulder we'll talk a little bit and yeah. then boom dinner and I'm championship like, yeah I'm like i know i get it the title was on oh, monica the, the, but you wanted come the European on they, they did an awesome job of setting up that tension that yep. i want to see monica in a game school her or at least not school her but get the upper hand mm -hmm. in this important game nope Nothing. I'd be, willing, I'd be yeah. willing to bet they shot some of that. It probably I hope they did. And it I found its way if there's a director's editing. cut or something. Yeah. I don't know. Before. It's Books, awesome. let us know if there is. Because I want to see it. If there is not anything, I feel slightly robbed. <laughs> it's just again, Monica. The, the, the Holding record, it off after Gina, she makes it. I, if I believe, if I remember correctly, Gina written, uh, wrote and directed this. I feel like... You did so awesome with that, and then you gave us nothing. Yeah. <laughs> but, but she could have wrote it in something to director to take it. I think it that was. I don't think that was about basketball at all. I think that was setting up them sharing their very, very different experiences. Because, it was. but yeah. at the same time, though, Dave, if I, if you and me are talking shit, and she's the freshman, <laughs> and she's but the it's junior. Not. It's you got to have a showdown. Yeah, it's not a sport. We got to see but the James, it's not This a, was a sport. It's not a sports movie. It was sports mixed That's in with a the life drama. movie. Hey, this hey, isn't a sports subjective movie. Basketball is in the subjective. title, guys. It's not a sports <laughs> movie. Subjective. There is sports in this. I would, you could still I give us. It's definitely a sports movie. It showed yeah. that you need to find. They, no. These are people okay. who needed to I'm, find I'm more not. in life than just basketball. And then they eventually found that because that's all. the. And you see that with pro athletes from the time they're five years old and they can dribble or run a football across the, the goal line that everything is football or basketball or their sport 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 and then they get done like they don't know what to do what they're to do re they're retired yeah. at like 25 28 30 and you know like oh, what do i the do one left europe and was working at a bookstore yeah so yeah. i mean sorry. Dave, that, yeah. Dave, back to dave no sorry. yeah so zeke i thought that was again like you said quinn he had his faults his flaws right but at the end of the day you can't you can't knock the guy for being a father because that he was every moment he could be a father as much as an NBA player could in this world. At yep. least what they've shown us on screen here, right? Yep. So uh, it was at every game. It was interesting to see it. that perspective. Then the at home perspective, where you know she, uh, the mom wanted you know time with the family. Of course, he was lying his ass off. <laughs> He's trash that way. Yep. You know, so I get where the mom was coming on that. She's like, and she said it out loud too. I accepted being second to the NBA. Yep. Yep. So I thought that was actually a pretty powerful line because there's a lot of people, uh, a lot of folks out there, you know, that take second for yep. a job career. Yeah, it was you important know, they noted that. Take NBA out of it, you know, depending on whatever, insert job. A lot of people yep. uh, end up doing that. So depending on the situation. But uh, I thought Monica, uh, gosh, I forgot her name already. Oh, Sa Sana. Sana Lafa. I'm butcher. I'm bad at pronouncing names. I'm just going to stick with Monica. The actress was phenomenal. No. Uh, I thought Omar and her, like Dave said, the chemistry was off the charts there. And th those two stories, I related a lot to, or their story, because we, I had a friend who, a uh, girlfriend, well, a friend who was a woman, because I don't want to say <laughs> I had a girlfriend. <laughs> Uh, she, we were pretty tight. It was never any kind of chemistry oh. in that way. Angie, you met her. Yeah. And, great, uh, great person. she was kind of like a Monica. <laughs> and I don't know yep. if you remember some of the times we went out, but she would be like, oh no, that host trash. You know, yeah. like, <laughs> like, she was almost like that. So I totally oh, yeah. related oh, to yeah. that. It was one of those where, you know, we could be honest with each other and didn't have to worry about any kind of weird tension or anything. So that was pretty cool to see that. Um, Dave, you hit it. I thought the Monica and Camille, the mom, mm -hmm. I thought that story was pretty impactful, right? So I won't ever be able to relate to a mother daughter because, uh, obviously, right? Yeah. So I don't, I won't ever have that, but I have heard, uh, through some of my friends and actually some of your comments, some people's comments in YouTube where they would explain the relationship. So I definitely understand like, uh, especially at when they laid it out. So at least I, uh, could understand it better where, you know, like you were saying, you know, the mom, I, I had two kids, you know, I did this, you know, mm -hmm. and it, 
I feel like we're probably going to have conversations. Some of us may even have conversations that, you know, when we're way older and our kids are Monica's age too, like, hey, you don't know what I had to stop doing mm-hmm. for that. I'm not trying to turn that into a man thing. I'm just saying it's a parent's thing. Uh, again, I thought that was incredibly powerful because we got to really understand the mom side of it. Because mm-hmm. let's just face it, Monica, at least in my opinion here, she was pretty rough around the edges anytime. Yeah mom was around and i feel like we can all kind of relate to that a little bit with kind of going after the parents somehow some i i'm guilty of sometimes uh you you kind of being lippy to my mom for no reason at all no reason at all so that's on me that's 100 (laughs) not my mom but again overall she's a lovely woman oh and i want to say hey gina if i'm saying uh, hopefully that's the director writer here i i love the uh, first person. Oh yes, uh, in the when basketball game, Monica was, awesome. was having that inner dialogue, mm-hmm. and then we got to see yeah. that first person shot. I thought that was incredible because I I don't think I've really seen that from a sports perspective in any sports film yeah. that I've watched. I mean, I've and seen not it. saying this is sports. Yeah, I mean, I've seen it in the program, debate. but that's about it. When they had you know Darnell was running, you had the inside the helmet view. That's the only I time think I've they seen did it. it a hand I, I think Team Wolf did it. Remember Team Wolf? Oh, maybe. I think. I think, it, I think it was. I think it was an old, an eighties thing. Wasn't he breathing though? Like in Team Wolf? Yeah, but it was yeah. like his perspective. But you could hear the heavy breathing. I think. He I think also he, did that in Doom. <laughs> Does that qualify? They sports? <laughs> that's not a sports movie. <laughs> and I don't know if it we're made the, the line yeah. what You're saying Teen here. Wolf, and I guess that's and a sports movie. I'd love to see some of your explanations for the uh, mother daughter relationship. Yeah. That the mother relationship or, or the mother's expectation uh, of Monica, yep. I thought was interesting too there because, at least to me, and I'm probably missing some stuff here. So if it went over my head, please. Please drop well, a comment. I, I think I, I think it was interesting that they showed a, a father, son, mother, daughter, and you had the father, son, where the son wanted to be exactly like the dad. Yep. He's who he wanted he to be. Like. Faults. And then the, the daughter didn't want to be anything yep. like the mom. Mm-hmm. And then in the end, the daughter, you know, obviously still different goals than the mom. But she started to but see the it a son point. was like, I don't want to be like dad. And I'll yeah. it, and the mom it's, actually ha- wanted to have the fight that her, yeah, her daughter had. The one thing I had. think yeah. that is, is what interesting. I got I think when your parents when your parents split when you're real little, it's the the kids don't always know why, right? Mm. Like I think when you're young, they don't know why. I think you know if you're 30 or 35 and you have parents who are in their 50s and they split, you know, life kind of happens, whatever. But I think when you're when you're that age, like a late teenager, the college age, and your parents are younger and they split, I would have to imagine, and I, I can't relate. My parents split when I was younger. I would have to imagine it's tough because you're old enough to understand like. Okay, something went wrong here, yeah. right? And you, you, yep. you know, you, you, their parents are their own individual people, but again, you want them to treat each other with respect because they're your parents. So you can't just be like, well, you're your own person and forgive it. But at right. the same time, like I said, being old enough to understand like what happened between your parents, it's, I think it's a tough time. But again, oh, all, yeah. all the storylines of this movie, including yeah. the basketball was, was 17. Yeah, it's, it was just so cool yeah, seeing a movie good. where everybody mm-hmm. has different perspectives and they're all kind of right in their own way mm-hmm. a little bit you know you could take something away from just about everybody in this movie I well, and it's i can relate for the sports i was 17 when my when i knew my parents were having troubles and we're gonna eventually split and that was during football season so I, those first few practices were like white noise and everything so yeah just that's that's going through the so like how he was messing up on the court you could totally understand it when you have something like that on your mind. Yeah. So. Well, and then the fight, and I think when you two brought that up too with Monica, that's why I wish they put uh, would have did a little bit more screen time on her. But they got the point over where Monica had to fight, fight, yeah, fight absolutely. for just an yeah. inch. Where they did a good job. Uh, Omar Quincy had to yeah. do nothing. Yeah. But I still yeah, wanted even, some more. Did they even show him? At, did they even show him at like a practice? They only no, showed him. No, they, no, they only practice. showed him hitting threes. No practice. All right, practice. I think it's score well, time. Yeah, yeah, score time. Yes. I will from from my score because I thought the story was really really good. I'm going to give it a four on this one. Uh, I I mean it's. I can't really find any hardcore nitpicks, but the reason why it is four, not a five, when I say that's because I don't know how many times I would actually go back and rewatch, mm. like I do with Dark Knight. So <clears throat> that's my standard. Always the standard. I, I thought it was a great story, great cast, great chemistry. 
solid four and a half. Out of me. Yep. Answer. I'm going to mirror you for me. This is a four and a half. Look, the four of us had a blast watching mm -hmm. this laughing in the beginning and getting super invested because it was oh. not obvious what was going to happen. And it was so much fun. So four and a half for me as real well. quick invested. Perfect. Yeah. Word for I'm, this. I'm, I, I guess I'm the high score. I'm going to go four, eight, five on this one. It's not quite a five. It's not a movie that I'm going to put up there, but as you know, answer just said between the acting, the story, the chemistry, music, and it, the, mu the music, the music was awesome. but it, it was able to hit, you know, and you know, I love my lessons and this movie was able to hit like growing up lessons, adult lessons, professional lessons, going after your dream lessons, the coach who's hard on you lessons, yep. just bam, 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 four, eight, five for me, a phenomenal movie. Yeah. Good, good Man. recommendation. Can't wait for the next that one. That was a regular. Awesome, awesome as always, what you guys. What page on? <laughs> I, uh, I got to watch that so I can finally get that reference. So for Diamond Dan, Appleton Oak, that's Mason Quinn. I'm, of course, the answer. Good night, pals.